ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿಂದಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನಂಗ ವಂದಿ ರಾಧಿಕಾ ಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಚಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶಕಿ ಪಾಸಿಂದು ಬೆವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಬ್ಬ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ಬಾಜಾಲಂಗ ಪಂಗುಂಗ್ ಲಂಘಯತಗಿರಿ ಜತ್ ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ಬಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸ್ವಚ್ಛ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸ್ವತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂಚ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿಂಗ್ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶೆ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶೋ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮದಾಕ ಜಗೋದ್ವರು ಧ್ಯೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಿರಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತಾತ್ಯುಹಂ ಪುನದ ಬಾಲ್ಯಭವಾದಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚರಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನ ಕಚಂದಮನಿ ಚಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರುಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗಬೋಧು ಸ್ವದರ್ಶ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಸ ಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಶಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮೈ ಕದಾ ಕಿಪಾಂಕರೋಷಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಹರೆ ರಾಮ ಹರೆ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೆ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕಾವದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲ ಯಥಾಕ್ಷ ವೀಶಾಂಬರು ದ್ವಿಜವರು ಜುಗಧಾರ್ಮಪಾಲೋ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೇ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋ ದಿವ್ಯರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಾಸಿ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷೀತ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯಮನಂಗಮದಾಪುಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ಯನಾಥ ಭಾಗೀ ಸಜಸ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ವಕ್ಷಸಿ ಜಸ್ತಿ ಸಂಬಿ ಪಂ ನಿಶಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ 
हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे गौरांग एक गति बजास्थित मति श्री गौर धाम स्थिति सात कविर कुसंग विरती दुष्टो व्यथा निष्कृति श्रीरूपक सनातन नति श्रीजीव तेजस्तुति श्री सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्री सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरी गोष्ठीपति गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपा टोल धर्मध्वजीगणर धर्म आचरण बद्ध जीव के आो अधिकतर बद्ध दशाय लइया जाए गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपा टोल दोज वर projecting the flag of dharma they have no etiquette no acharan nothing only they have the flag of dharma they want to prove that we are preacher we are doing following dharma vaishnav dharma proper speaking common people if they are going to follow them they can arrange more and more bondage for them more and more bondage previously maybe some bondage was there but at present due to this asas sangha dharma dhaji those who are putting the flag of dharma in hand to prove that we are preacher we are preacher we are following dharma if bonded soul common people going to follow them they are going to ensure more and more bondage for them you can remember yesterday i was discussing about actual preaching the vital point i was speaking that krishna bhakti bina nahi bhakti pavartan if i don't have krishna bhakti myself the power of krishna bhakti i cannot install bhakti inside the heart of any bonded soul not possible and also yesterday i was discussing this vital point that the day i can realize that my harikatha is number one topmost you know procedure of bhajan the day i can realize that my speaking harikatha is you know very nice bhajan for me in that case surely i am going to get the backing of you know kripa from guru varga yukta vairagya surely i am going to enjoy the kripa of that yukta vairagya otherwise this kind of feeling cannot touch my heart actually some people they are busy with acharan and some are busy with prachar but एसपा दस सिद्धांत व भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी रघुर प्रभुपात सारस्वत गौरीय संप्रदाय इट इज वेरी नाइस सिद्धांत वी ऑलरेडी गॉन थ्रू चैतन्य चैतन्य में तो यू कैन रिमेम्बर आचार करे केहो ना करे प्रचार प्रचार करे केहो ना करे आचार आचार प्रचार नामेर करो हो दुई कार्य तुम सर्वगुरु तुम जगतर आर्य Sanatan Goswami is speaking to Haridas Thakur. Some are busy with acharan only, and some are busy with uh, prachar. But you are doing both, achar, acharan, and pracharan. So you are actually nam acharya. So you are topmost. Achar, prachar, na mere karo ho dui karje. You are doing both. Out of your stainless character and bhajan procedure you are showing an example in front of 
whole world that how to do bhajan how to love prabhu how to go out of maya you are giving lesson to all people actually prabhupada also speaking about yukto vairagya many time especially the writing k vaishnav who is vaishnav this article there you can find vaishnavi pratishtha tate karanishtha tahana kalire rovibe rourab perhaps you know vaishnavi pratishtha tate karanishtha tahana kalire rovibe rourab rourab man narak hell if you are not going to show proper honor exact honor to vaishnavi pratishtha in that case if you are going to ignore vaishnavi pratishtha to prove that you are a great vaishnav you don't need any pratishtha you are going to lead you know solitary bhajan this way if you want to project yourself your importancy in that case you can go to hell <coughs> vaishnavi pratishtha you must understand what do you mean by vaishnavi pratishtha i can also touch another point which is very important then i can clarify this point very easily so vaishnavi pratishtha mean any pratishtha given by guru vaishnav that pratishtha should not touch my heart that vaishnavi that pratishtha cannot contaminate my heart i should realize this pratishtha given by a whole world to me it is actually due with my gurudev and my gurudev also think can think that way that the pratishtha is due with his gurudev i mean my param gurudev this way one by one all pratishtha can go as puspanjali on to the lotus feet of nitananda valaram dadi guru and in madhura saradhani i don't like to speak right now so you see this is called vaishnavi pratishtha if i say i should not speak vaishnavi pratishtha because people can hear me they can give me pratishtha is all wrong conception wrong siddhanta actually prabhu was speaking pratishtha ro tare nirjana re ghare tab hari naam ke wala koitya prabhu was speaking to get pratishtha you want to do inside a solitary castle <clears throat> but to get that kind of pratishtha you are doing it and you are doing harinam but it is one kind of falsity in a false bhajan pratishtha ro tare nirjana ro ghare tab harinam keval koitya we should remember this point and vaishnavi pratishtha tate karanishtha tahana korire rovibe rouro any kind of pratishtha maybe the whole world can give pratishtha to me what it concern to me if it is not at all if this pratishtha not going to contaminate my heart i can have a niskinchan bhav by the power of my gurudev param gurudev guru varga then what problem in it what problem in it also we should remember that what prabhu was speaking সে দুটি কথা ভুল না সর্বদা কর উচ্চস্বরে হরিনাম রব দ্যাট টু ওয়ার্ড ইউ শুড নট ফরগেট অ্যান্ড গো অন ডুইং হরিনাম সংকীর্তন ভেরি লাউডলি পবা স্পিকিং সে দুটি কথা ভুল না সর্বদা কর উচ্চস্বরে হরিনাম রব নাও ডি বোট ইজ আস্কিং মি মারা সে দুটি কথা দ্যাট টু ওয়ার্ডস হোয়াট ডু মিন হোয়াট পবাজ ওয়ান্টেড টু স্পিক many time before i was bound to reply that seduti katha mean tumi amar ami to tomar tumi to amar ki kaj aparadhane tumi to amar ami to tomar ki kaj aparadhane you are my property hey prabhu i am yours so what what third property i need nothing i need nothing i need actually this is the main property and this is called the basic thing of sambandha gyan vital point of sambandha gyan and after developing this sambandha gyan i can i can start my effort 
how to satisfy supreme lord the best possible way what is the best possible way to satisfy supreme lord in this kali kal hari naam sankirtan many times in hari katha i was bound to discuss this point so prabha speaking seduti katha bhulo na sarvada kar uchcha sare hari naam ra loudly you will have to do hari naam ra hari gaur hari bol and hari naam ra means hari naam sankirtan at the same time to sing the glories of supreme lord from bhagavatam or siddhanta which are everything many time before i discuss those who are following hari katha they can understand very easily hari mean hari mean actually we will have to naam prabhu naam prabhu hari naam prabhu hari naam prabhu dham prabhu dham naam hari naam naam parikar naam vaishishtya naam lila naam all different kind of in the varieties of the explanation of is hari supreme lord so it is advised by prabhupada the seduti katha bhulo na sarvada karo uchcha sare hari naam ra this is the vital point we should remember this the vaishnavi pratishtha we should not ignore we should not hate at the same time i was bound to discuss this two point about yukta vairagya you can remember that day i was the, the other day i was bound to discuss this point that anasaktas visayano yatharho mupujanyata this point and prapanchikataya buddhya hari sambandhi vastuno in very easy way prabhupad representing this word very easy way uh, easily wow बोले कृष्ण सेवाय जहाँ हई अनुकूल विषय बलिया तहा त्यागी हई भूल व्हाट यू कैन यूज वेरी नाइसली इन हरि सेवा व्हाट व्हाट यू कैन यूज इन हरि सेवा वेरी नाइसली इफ यू आर गोइंग टू रिजेक्ट दैट थिंग इट इज नॉट युक्त भाई राग्या कृष्ण सेवाय जहाँ अनुकूल व्हिच इज फेवरेबल व्हिच कैन हेल्प यू टू मेन्थेन युक्त भाई राग्या कृष्ण सेवाय जहाँ हई अनुकूल विषय बोली हाथ त्यागे हई भूल यू कैन नट यू शुड नट रिजेक्ट दैट थिंग एज अ मेटेरियल ऑब्जेक्ट नॉट दैट दे इज अ सिक्रेसी ऑफ युक्त वैराग्य इज दैट हाउ बेस्ट पॉसिबल वे यू कैन यूज इट फॉर द टोटल सैटिस्फैक्शन ऑफ सुप्रीम लॉर्ड दिस इज द मेन पॉइंट सो एक्चुअली this is very vital point actually you should remember that prabhu was speaking those who are projecting those who are holding the flag of dharma bhagavad dharma and those who are not having any achara or anything for common people it is really very dangerous all over the world this problem is that how to detect how to know so many time i was bound to a, reply give the answer of this question if you are sincere 100 100% sincere yourself then be sure balaji maharaj watching you going to provide going to give you divine help automatically keep because it is the responsibility of nitanand balaram to help all those bonded soul those who are interested to cross this material world so also about nitananda ashtakam there i already told you know it is written by krishnadas kaviraj goswami that krishnadas kaviraj goswami reading that nitananda it is the standing commitment of nitananda prabhu ato ba sansaram buditaran dayo moi laget the total responsibility lying with me the only thing you will have to do that you have to speak gaur hari amare kinya laho amare kinyal ho bhajo gaur hari you will have to be sincere 100% then it is my responsibility to help you to cross the material ocean and to get bhakti it is my responsibility how to arrange bhakti sarv shakti for you so actually i like to quote another point is very important 
that very often prabhupad used to speak an acharya can never be elected by vote an acharya can never be elected by vote gauriya gosthipati sila sisila bhakti siddhant saraswati goswami thakur pahupa said that acharya can never be elected by voting system acharya is self effulgence self manifested object at present the system of election to choose an acharya in any society is never approved by any authentic shastras that is the point what to do and what not to do all our activities should be approved by authentic scripture authentic shastras what to do what not to do what to do what not to do all our activities should be approved by authentic scriptures <coughs> shastras that is why <coughs> this is the standing instruction of shri krishna in gita what bhagwan sri krishna speaking in gita it is a standing instruction of bhagwan sri krishna in gita tasmat shastra pramanam te karya karyo vyavasthita tasmat shastra pramanam te karya karyo vyavasthita this is one instruction tasmat mane that is why i am speaking arjun you will have to go through shastra you will have to get the advice of sadhu guru vishnu also authentic personalities so tasmat shastra pramanam te karya karyo vyavasthita so sadhu guru vishnu those are realized soul when they are giving advice it is also approved by shastra automatically so tasma shastra pramanam te karya karyo vyavasthita also we can see the strict instruction of shastra i already told the other day that shuti siti puranaadi pancharatring bidhing bina oi kanti ki harer bhaktir utpatai bakalpate shuti siti puranaadi pancharatring shuti siti puranaadi pancharatrik bidhing bina oi kanti ki harer bhaktir upat utpatai bakalpate although engaged in single minded devotion to see to see hari if one transgress if one going to transgress the regulations maintained mentioned in the suti smriti purans and narad pancharatra bhagavatam undeserved undeserved qualities are produced on the other hand over 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 jealous over jealous concern for the rules and regulation of bhakti which disregards the mood and injunctions of scriptures simply becomes a disturbance to society it is not actually bhakti so shruti siti purana adi if if what i am doing my activity is all my siddhant all my acharan if not approved by shruti siti purana adi pancharatting vidhi that kind of bhakti what i want to show in front of public people that is just one kind of hazard problem utpat oi kan the harer bhakti utpatai bhakti it is nothing but one kind of problems you know so you see pitama vishwa also yesterday i was speaking pitama vishwa was very angry when unnecessarily gurudev going to speak all rabis against him giving some instruction which is not you know proper so pitama vishwa vishwa singing gururupi abalitap so गुरुरूपी अवलित सो कर्जा कार्यो म जान तो उत्पत प्रतिपन्न सो परित्याग विधीय थे इफ दैट काइंड ऑफ गुरु हु इज गोइंग टू स्पीक ऑल राबिस विच इज नॉट अप्रूव बाय एनी अथेंटिक स्क्रिप्चर्स दैट काइंड ऑफ गुरु आई शुड 
I should throw away. I should not. Many such cases happen. Many such cases, and I don't like to speak clearly. That Guru Dev was very nice previously. Halfway in his bhajan, after that he developed some vanity, then fall down. In that case, what what whatever initiation was given, they all fall down. That Guru fall down. initiation also useless so you see many such cases after prabhupad one acharya was elected but i know i know sila arunna maharaj and so many devotees i don't like to speak clearly uh, here because so many devotees going to hear they cannot digest it they can feel problem so i like to avoid this point so after prabhupad somebody was elected acharya uh, so he was fall down after that those vaishnav great vaishnav there they now actually they took decision to leave that guru they actually took maybe hari naam from prabhupad they took diksha from that guru but they leave that guru and finally from heart they are going to follow prabhupad follow prabhupad from heart this way they came out successful also it is the rules that if guru fall down then you will have to approach a nice guru sadguru to to do pro- bhajan properly and also it is a system if go if your gurudev is not सदगुरु एज यट मा बी मध्यम अधिकारी सदगुरु बार मध्यम अधिकारी एंड टप मोस्ट परमहंस स्टेज नॉट एटेंडेड एज यट इन दैट केज इट इज अस्टम स्टील इफ मेजर फॉल्ट्स आर नॉट एवेलेबल विथ योर गुरुदेव यू कैन नॉट लिव दैट गुरु मे बी मध्यम अधिकार वाट यू कैन डू विद द परमिशन ऑफ योर गुरुदेव यू विल हैव टू अप्रोच अ वेरी नाइस शिक्षा गुरु so is one kind of compensating factor so by the permission of gurudev you can approach a sadguru a shiksha guru who can give you power i mean give siddhanta vichar bhajan you can you can learn bhajan from him and one condition here that if you find that that shiksha guru going to hit your gurudev diksha guru then you cannot approach that shiksha guru if if that shiksha guru having sufficient respect for your diksha guru in that case you can accept him and not only that it is one kind of compensating factor through this procedure finally you can attain perfection no doubt you can attain perfection no doubt in future that's why the other day i was discussing about one siddhanta given by sir jibu gosain pad that siddhanta you can remember the other day i was discussing that gurva gaya tat sevan abirodhena cha anneshanu anneshanu pi vaishnavanam sevanam shreya gurva gaya tat sevan abirodhena cha anneshanu pi vaishnavanam sevanam shreya all the vaishnav by the consent of your gurudev shiksha diksha guru you can go ahead you can go and take the association of a shiksha guru who is having respect for your diksha guru and if you if this is sampradayik sadhu is more adva- you can get advantage very good advantage you can go on and finally you can get perfection no doubt in it so this way you can remember that is why the sahajya they are going to criticize about our guru parampara i was bound to write one book on guru parampara is is uh, madha gauri sampraday i mean gauriya mission gauriya mat they have no connection with madha gauri's madha sampraday madha gauri sampraday i was bound to give so clear answer on this point the another vital point i like to project that prabhupada when writing guru parampara you can find that halfway prabhupad giving mantra parampara halfway prabhupad giving mantra parampara and halfway halfway prabhupad giving bhagavat parampara so this is the 
procedure approved by Pancharatik Vidhan and by Prabhupada also going to prove that Mantra Parampara sometime can break. Not that hundred hundred percent you can prove that Mantra Parampara always perfect. Mantra Parampara is okay. Mantra Parampara, if if Mantra Parampara is okay, then Mantra Parampara, I know you can. You can follow, but some, but uh, uh, most of the cases we find that mantra parampara is not uh, some breakage you can find. In that case, to get the mainstream of bhakti, how to get the mainstream of bhakti? You will have to make the connection again through Bhagavat parampara, like Krishna ite chotur mukhai Krishna sevan mukhai already told. And uh, Mahaprabhu Sri Chaitanya Radha Krishna he onno Rupanu ko janeru jiban Rupopiyo Mahajana jiboru gunato hano Tarpiyo kubiyo kavi Krishna Das Krishna Dasu piyo varo naatmo seva paro jarpade vishana tuva this way you can see that when I am speaking about naatmo the same group Sinibha Sachajyo Samananda Prabhu Ramchandra Kaviraj why I am not speaking you are foolish. Actually, it is understood when I am speaking the name of Narottama, all the groups are present. No problem. This way, Bhagavat Parampara, you can harmonize totally the break, the break already broken linkage. You can reset and start your bhajan through Bhagavat Parampara. And uh, Mantra Parampara, not always you can find, uh, you know, cannot find success all the time. So, Bhagavat Parampara, you can. Mantra Parampara and Bhagavat Parampara, the Pope are speaking this way. So, by now you understand the secrecy of, you know, this uh, Acharya Si, Bhagavat Parampara, all I am speaking in detail, all I am speaking in details. So, Acharya is self-manifested object. So, Acharya can never be elected by any voting system. There is 100% perfect. So, at present I am going to discuss uh, on this topic sexually, although, you know, I already answered but still I like to give some special point. Actually, Srila Prabhupada was, uh, mm, actually, Sila, I can give the example from the life and the Leela of Srila Prabhupada itself. So, actually, Srila Prabhupada was Nitya Siddha Acharya. Actually, Srila Prabhupada was Nitya Siddha Acharya. Sadhana Siddha Acharya also you can get, no problem. When you can get Sadhana Siddha Acharya, you should not insult him. It's very nice. Same, you know. So, Sadhana Siddha Acharya, but actually this is not the case with our Guru Bhargava. Like Prabhupada, Bhakti Vinod Thakur, Prabhupada, Parambijat Kesu Gusi Maharaj, Sisira Siddhar Gusi Maharaj. He, Srila Bhakti Pumatpuri Krishna Maharaj, they are not Sadhan Siddha Acharya. They are Nitya Siddha. They are eternal persons of Prabhupada. Somebody can fight on this point. Everybody, those who took Harinam Diksha from Prabhupada, they are all, you know, Nitya Siddha Parsha. No, 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 not that. This Siddhanta is not perfect. Eh? This Siddhanta is not perfect. Those who are going to satisfy Prabhupada 100%, those who are going to install the ideas of Prabhupada, Siddhanta Vichara of Prabhupada, Gaura Pestaya Bhutale. Eh? You can find this mantra always you are saying, eh? Gaura Pestaya Bhutale, Gaura Pestaya Bhutale. Eh? Eh? Or about Prabhupada, it is Rupanugo, Viruddha Pasiddhanta, Apasiddhanta Harine, you can find. This way, those who are going to install Siddhanta Vichar, implement all Siddhanta Vichar and etiquette, all instruction of Prabhupada Siddhanta Vichar in this material world. Sri Chaitanya Mano Bhishtam Sthapitam Jena Bhutale. Mano Bhishtam Mani, the desire of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. What is the desire? Pithiviti Achiyato Nagaradi Gam Sarvatta Prachar Haive Mornam. So, Prithivitya Achayyata Nagaradi Gam Sarvatta Prachar Haivya Mornam. Somehow, Mahaprabhu speaking, all village and you know, cities of the whole world, in the whole world, 
there you can find some day my name going on everybody going to chant sing my name prithvi ji achu yato nagar adigam sarvatta prachar hoibe monna prachar hoibe monna also i was speaking about the qualities of those preacher very accurately you should understand so sri chaitanya manobhishtam sthapitam yena bhutale those who are going to you know implement the desire of chaitanya mahaprabhu in this material world they are eternal parsad of goranga mahaprabhu and those are guru bargo those who wanted to install the Siddh, install all the siddhanta vichar of sri pavpat in this material world pavpat and bhakti vinod thakur they are surely nitya siddha parshad and those who are going to take hari naam diksha all they are not nitya siddha parshad those who are going to break the instruction of pavpat going to start a new track that's why i already mentioned sutis jade sruti siti puran adi pancharatang bidhing bina oi kan theke harer bhakti er utpato ibo kalpati how you can understand that this this devotee enjoying full kripa of gurudev how you can understand you forget many time before i told if you can find all the siddhanta vichar of gurudev all his acharan all his siddhanta all his etiquette all if you can find in applied form in the life of one devotee be sure he is snigdha shishya from bhagavatam we can find one slok snigdha shishya sa guru bo gujham api utho so if we can find that our guru bargo they are going to implement all the siddhanta vichara pavat bhakti siddhanta saraswati gushan they are going to implement guru pad padme used to say pro pad pro pad pro pad pro every fraction of second those are going to in each and every breath breathing so they are actually eternal parshad of pro pad those who are going to break the instruction of pro pad procedure of pro pad of preaching they are going to start a new procedure surely 100% they are not parshad maybe they can come out successful in first half of their life first because some some sort of you know humble attitude maybe was there with him but later on develop you know some vanity some false ego i am the preacher then fall down how we can discover all is siddhanta vichar everything all is you know already i told about uh, pitama vishwa eh गुरु रूपी अविल तपस्व कर जा कर जम जान तो उत्पत प्रतिपन्न स परित्याग विधि थे इफ नाउ आई फाइन प्रीवियसली नॉट नाउ आई फाइन गुरुदेव स्पीकिंग ऑल राबिश एगेंस्ट ऑल गुरु वर्ग इज दैट पौपा देन बी श्योर सम फॉल डाउन इज दैट सो यू ट्राई टू अवॉइड हिम यू के नॉट गेट एनी पावर फ्रॉम हिम सो दिस इज अ सिद्धांत विचार यू शुड फॉलो दिस पॉइंट सो सो इफ यू फाइन the all the etiquette all the siddhanta vichar all everything in applied form in the life of one disciple then be sure he is snigdha shishya he is the actual shishya going to follow his gurudev in total and and the rest you know they are not following maybe following 50% 80% so you can also remember i was speaking that day the quotation of pahupa pahupa giving instruction the slightest deviation from the track of your guru path padma can ultimately throw you away from bhajan so this way there is a great danger this world is now passing through a critical period very critical period whereas in upanishad also you can find that khuras sadhara निश्चया दुर्गम पतस्तत्कवयो वदंती कठोपनिषद ऑन द फुलिश पीपल दे आर रनिंग ओवर ए शार्प यू नो यू नो शोर्ट एनी टाइम दे कैन काट देयर लेग यू नो एनी टाइम सो ऑल द टाइम त्रिनाथ विभाग हम्बल सबमिशन कैन हेल्प यू टू प्रोटेक्ट योर वजन ऑल्सो समे आई कैन डिस्कस वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट अबाउट सम 
some instruction specially given by Srila Prabhupada to some of his friends. Prabhupada never used to say they are my disciples. Prabhupada used to say they are all my friends. I have some, I have some, I have, I have some request, I have some request for my, some of my friends, those who are going to foreign country for preaching. Before going for foreign country, uh, I like to speak something. I, what I saw from my Guru Pat Padma Paramahansa Gurudev Gorkisar Babaji Maharaj, how Guru Kishore Babaji Maharaj was successful to catch me, attract me. The procedure I like to show you, that is called actually Tinadabhi Bhav. Without Tinadabhi Bhav, if I am going to, you know, draw your attention, I am going to put some influence on you due to my, you know, nice speech, that kind of influence cannot stay for long. That is short time benefit you can get. In the long run, because I myself not following Trinadha Vibhava, if, my, if I am myself not following Trinadha Vibhava, then how I can give, you know, uh, you know, benefit to you? Benefit will? If I am not established in the Acharan shown by Mahaprabhu, then my preaching is half done, half done. Also, uh, that day he was speaking, half truth is not truth. Half truth is more dangerous than false. I know, lie. Half truth is more dangerous than lie. Actually, now I come back to the point. Actually, Sila Prabhupada was Nitya Siddha Acharya, right from the beginning of his life. Right from the right from the right from the beginning of his life, this kind of indication was found. One or two or three examples I can give in front of you to clarify this point. You can understand very easily how I am speaking this way. One or two or three example I am going to keep in front of you to understand this point. Very long ago when, uh, when, when the teacher of Bhimala Prasad, I mean he was a small boy. Long ago, when Prabhupada was a small boy, when his when his teacher, when when his teacher, I mean home tutor, when his teacher Pithiraj Sarma, when his teacher Pithiraj Sarma, from whom he used to learn Veda, Vedanta, everything, Vyakaran, everything, when his teacher Pithiraj Sarma one day one day told him. One day told him, advised him to put heavy energy in the study of intricate subjects like Ved, Vedanta, everything to become successful, to become a successful Pandit, great Pandit. So he, uh, one day he advised him, you will have to put heavy energy. Uh, to go through all intricate subjects, I mean Shastras and everything, to become a great Pandit in near future. Then that small boy, I mean Prabhupada, he told straightway that it is not at all, it is not at all my target to become a great Pandit. It is not at all my final target to become a great Pandit. Rather, I would like to put all my energy for Bhagavad Seva, which is my ultimate goal of life. To hear the answer from this, this small boy, like, like uh, Bhimala Prasad, the master was really very surprised. Another day, another day, Another day, another incident I am speaking. One day, um, one day, when Sila Bhaktivinoda Thakur went to market, one day, when Bhaktivinoda Thakur went to market to bring some ripe mangoes from market, so it was put at, it was, uh, it was, put by Bhaktivinoda Thakur inside room. So when 
some ripe mangoes were brought from market by Srila Bhakti Nur Thakur. Then the boy took some, took one mango uh, without permission to check the test, I mean sweetness of the mango. But immediately he was checked by Srila Bhakti Nur Thakur not to do so, not to do so anymore. Not to do so anymore. When he was informed by Srila Bhakti Vinod Thakur that before offering, before offering to Supreme Lord, before offering anything, before offering anything to Bhagwan, it is not the rule to take anything. Okay, okay. He took lesson <laughs> like a small boy. Then onward. He took resolution to avoid taking mango in his whole life. Then from, from then onward, Prabhupada took resolution to avoid taking mango in his whole life. You understand what I mean to say? You see the resolution. So, not only that, but also he was given responsibility by Srila Bhaktivinu Thakur to worship Kurmo Deva Salagram. He was given responsibility in his childhood, I mean boyhood, to worship Kurmo Deva Salagram by Srila Bhaktivinu Thakur. He was given responsibility. Watching his excellent seva mood right from the beginning of his life. Bhakti Mun Thakur was bound to give because, because watching his exclusive seva mood right from the beginning of his life. Another incident I would like to speak. Surely this, this incident can touch uh, our heart to give us a direct feeling of his eternal Acharya Sip. Ananda Sankar. Annoda Sankar, not Ananda Sankar, Annoda Sankar. <coughs> Annoda Sankar, the other son of Srila Bhakti Vinod Thakur. Annoda Sankar, Annoda Sankar, Annoda Sankar, the other son of Srila Bhakti Vinod Thakur. I mean, from his previous wife, who already gone by that time. So, he was very, very sick with high fever and strong headache due to some unknown disease and due to some unknown unknown disease almost to the last stage of life almost the last stage of life almost the last stage of life is going to leave body so sickness heavy sickness That day, evening time, Sila Sachidananda Bhakti Vinod Thakur took decision. That day, evening, Sila Sachidananda Bhakti Vinod Thakur took decision to engage Sila Bhimala Prasad Saraswati, I mean Sila Paupar, to chant Harinam loudly whole night in front of that patient, Annoda Prasad. So, as per the order, I mean instruction of Srila Bhakti Vinod Thakur, Prabhupada was engaged in this seva. He was engaged to do so, this seva. I mean Harinam Sankirtan, whole night, in front of that patient. The whole night, the, the whole night he, I mean Srila Prabhupada, went on chanting Harinam Mahamantra loudly and really, it was a miracle, it was a miracle that before dawn, before, mo before dawn, you know, that Jivatma, I mean, Annada Sankar was supposed to leave his body. And everybody, including Bhakti Vinod Thakur, all were present, in, all present there. They all were present there. Suddenly, the Jivatma started praying in front of Bhimala Prasad very 
with with a very appealing mood that jivatma who is going to leave the body praying in front of bimala prasad with a very appealing mood cravingly that he is speaking due to my previous aparad unto the lotus feet of bimala prasad i was bound to take birth i was bound to take birth in this family to get a scope chance to hear harinam mahamantra from him from bimala prasad which is just which is now just completed now so i am going to leave my body after praying after praying i know after praying this way i mean begging for apology unto the lotus feet of sila paupad he was about to leave his body just last moment he was speaking that i was ramanuja Ra ramanuja sampradayik sadhu i was a sadhu from ramanuja sampraday i was a ramanuja sampradayik sadhu in my previous life he was speaking that way really so all tilak all in different parts of our body 12 dada sangha 12 parts of our body really so all tilaks all in different parts of body appear in his body automatically it was visible very clearly everybody could see and with some extraordinary body effulgence some light as if coming from his body this way ultimately he was bound to leave his body but we have a great you know opportunity to understand this point that sila prabhupad is nitya siddha acharya sila sachidananda bhakti thakur could realize all in details about the eternal acharya sip of sila prabhupad much before sila sachidananda bhakti thakur he could realize all in detail about all in detail about the eternal acharya sip of sila prabhupad much before very so sila bhakti vinod thakur was bound to write this following words saraswati krishna priya krishna bhakti tahar hiya vinodaro sei se vaibha saraswati krishna priya krishna bhakti tahar hiya vinodaro sei se vaibha you understand the meaning bhakti vinod thakur wanted to declare that saraswati bimala prasad saraswati prabha is uh, eternally he is actually krishna priya krishna shakti manjari and krishna bhakti krishna bhakti is his is his heart whole krishna bhakti saru shakti covering the whole body and mind of prabhupad krishna bhakti tahar hiya hiya mean body his body is full transcendent body made up bhakti is you know you can remember abir bhakti thi of prabhupad i was bound to discuss this point kipaya hari ketan murti dharam darani varaharak gaur janam जनकादिक वासल स्निग्ध पदम प्रणमा सदा प्रभुपाद पदम प्रणमा सदा प्रभुपाद पदम प्रणमा सदा प्रभुपाद पदम सो भक्ति मिठ ठाकुर राइटिंग दिस वे सरस्वती कृष्ण प्रिया कृष्ण भक्ति तहा रहिया विनोद रही सब विनोद विनोद मीन विनोद मीन Bhakti Vinod Thakur. Somebody speaking. It is Bhakti Vinod Thakur speaking about himself, or other way. I can make another meaning. Vinod means Vinod Bihari. I am in mean Krishna. 
एंड इज द बई भाव ऑफ पाउपाद इज द बई भाव ऑफ विनोद विनोदानंद है विनोद प्राण राधा विनोद प्राण राधा विनोद आनंद राधा विनोद बिहारी आई मीन कृष्ण विनोद और सही से वही भाव द बोत मीनिंग यू कैन यू कैन कैच नो हार्म इन इट सिला सचिदानंद भक्ति ठाकुर कूड रियलाइज मच बिफोर अबाउट द यूनिक आचार्य शिव ऑफ सिला प्रभुपा so he was bound to give a big responsibility on him before leaving body i can discuss all in details some day in near future before leaving body i can discuss all about you know bali gai sammelan bali gai you know dharma sabha i can discuss about what all different kind of instruction given by guru kishor baba ji maharaj to prabhupad what all different kind of you know responsibility given to uh, bimala prasad ha eh, instruction advice by prabhupad i can speak all in details today or tomorrow only by the mercy of guru varga all devotees those who are going to listen actually they are giving me kripa so that i can speak nicely so otherwise i cannot remember if you all are very become very angry with me then i cannot speak anything so your kripa is a must in my life so bhakti vinod thakur giving responsibility about daiva varnasram how to install daiva varnasram how to restart vishnu vaishnav ras sabha vishnu vaishnav ras sabha dham pacharani sabha how to install dham parikrama how to install all the procedure how to preach chaitanya vani properly all i can discuss not now day by day i can go on discussing all in details about what kind of instruction given by gaurkishor baba ji maharaj to pro eh uh, to popat what kind of instruction given by bhakti mun thakur to popat what all are the fallacy how we can understand that what bhakti mun thakur you know what popat doing is just perfect we can give example one by one gauriya goshtipati sera bhakti siddhant saraswati goshtami tagar popat popat ana gauriya goshtipati sisila bhakti siddhant saraswati goshtami tagar popat was was all along been in favor of ekayan paddhati why i am bound to put this point here there was so long time i am discussing about very critical point of anugatha everything so it is the appropriate place where i should discuss this point i cannot overlook this point gauriya goshtipati sisila bhakti siddhant saraswati goshtami jagat bhopa was all along been in favor of ekayan paddhati of veda of shrimad bhagavatam which is the most secret aspect of bhagavad bhajan what do you mean by ekayan paddhati ekayan pantha means no separate i mean individual efforts no separate individual efforts are allowed to project project himself separately ignoring the ignoring the ignoring ignoring the exact track of anugatha ekayan pantha it means no separate individual efforts are allowed for anybody to project himself separately ignoring the exact track of anugatha <coughs> in other sense i would like to say all and everything all and everything of seva efforts should be channelized through <coughs> all and everything of seva efforts all and everything of seva efforts should be channelized through the authentic and unique perceptual channel nobody can deserve nobody can deserve any credit for anything all honor or respect etc all pratishtha i mean vaishnavi pratishtha etc 
cannot contaminate the heart of any individual sevak all should be all should all should go and go ultimately unto the lotus feet of original source unto the lotus feet of nichananda prabhu balram adi guru or adarani in madura sa so all our gauriya guru varga all our gauriya guru varga they all used to believe this point very strong uh, with strong faith they used to fall they all used to believe this point with strong faith uh, all our guru varga they all used to believe with strong faith with strong faith in this ekayan pantha path except a few those who already fall down so you should understand this vital point to go further into the deep philosophy i mean siddhanta vichar of sila pavapat is very typical until and unless you are 100% inclined and to lotus feet of pavapat you cannot understand anything so actually after all i would like to say that this bhagavad dharma or atma dharma or vaishnav dharma is you know is specially you know approved for those paramahamsa nirma saranam satam nirma sasadu guru vaishnav it is specially approved for them so in bhagavatam we find nirma saranam satam भागवत निमग निगम कल्पतरोगलित बल सुख मुखाद अमृत दव संगीत ये श्लोक यू शुड डिस्कस सो दिस भागवत धर्म इज टॉप मोस्ट आत्म धर्म वैष्णव धर्म आत्म धर्म भागवत धर्म दिस इज स्पेशली अप्रूव्ड फॉर दोज परम हंस निर्मा सर साधु गुरु वैष्णव दोज हु आर हैविंग dangerous incurable disease what kind of disease jealousy inside heart for pure guru vaishnava sadhu guru vaishnava they are not they cannot have any actual entry they can prove that we are also following gauriya mat we are also going to you know uh, preach uh, chaitanya vani but not that they cannot have any actual entry inside the area inside the area of actual seva field because all their efforts are to do something for them to name to arrange name fame and position everything for themselves they want to start one new organization news you know ignoring gauriya mission gauriya mart they like to throw gauriya mart but they don't know it is impossible Gauriya Mart is eternally present. Maybe some foolish and idiot people doing some mistake, mistake, and you know all rubbish in Gauriya Mart. But be sure they are not in Gauriya Mart. They are not in Gauriya Mart. Be sure about you. So, what is the symptom that you are from Gauriya Mart? The symptom that we can understand the symptom that if you are following Prabhupada and Bhakti Mandal Thakur. you are going to follow in toto all the instructions and siddhanta vichar of bhakti mayur jagur and prabhat then surely you are from gauriya mat i can say so it is the standing you know you know standing advice of sila prabhat that bhakti vinod dara can never be extinct so we can remember so to get enough power and energy we must think all our guru varga all our previous guru varga waiting to help us they are waiting to help us so no problem we can go ahead with the with the actual preaching mission started by started by whom chaitanya mahaprabhu and is you know started by bhakti mayur tagur popa this means actually we cannot see actually there in the sankirtan jagyagni always glow always glowing 
but we cannot see. We can find the Pope was freshly again started. Actually, the that is eternally present there. So Pope was only started to show us. That Sankirtan Jagyangni all is going on. All our Guru Varga are going to help us. All our Guru Varga are going to bless us, provided we are going, we are ready to sacrifice our life into the fire of into the fire of Sankirtan Jagyangni. We are ready to sacrifice, sacrifice our life. Why not? Whereas we can find all freedom fighters, they are ready to sacrifice their life for motherland. Why we cannot sacrifice our life for Popat? Bhakti Shidanta says, why we can criticize Popat and Gauri Mission? Why? So, this is a point we should think over and again to understand this vital point, secret point. Who is preacher, actual preacher, who is not. So, another point is very important. I like to give you a reminder that those who are living in the room made of glass should not throw stone to others. <laughs> really so. Actually, one vital point. I was bound to read it in my syllabus when I was when a boy in 10th class. <laughs> that time, I can remember. So, their advice, their, this kind of advice was there in the book. In the article, that those who are living in the room made of glass should not throw stone to others. Why? Because if he is going to throw stone to others, then other people, they can throw stone to them, to, to you. In that case, you can break your glass room, which is very costly. They can also throw stone to break your glass room. So it is good that don't try to throw stone to others. Uh, so they are also not going to stone, uh, throw stone to you. But the name of the article was very fantastic. What is the name? Old Proverbs Made New. Name of the article Pesi was there. Old Proverbs Made New. Very excellent. What is that? The name of the article I already speak. But the writer now going to give argument in favor of his you know judgment in favor of his conception you know in that case the um, so now at present it is just opposite you know if you are going to live in the room of glass you should not throw stone to others previously it was true but at present old proverbs made new you have to you have to change the conception what is the change but if you are going to throw stone in that case every pos every possibility there for them to break their own glass room because they are staying in glass room <coughs> but new conception is effective at present what is that this means that those who are standing on uh, you know this means though this means that those who are standing on a false background they should not attack any other people or organization because otherwise they are going to invite problem they can also attack those who are standing on a false platform there are many faults drawback in their organization and their life how many you know black points drawbacks they should not attack any other people or any any people or organization because otherwise they are going to invite problem for themselves automatically but this essay name of the essay was just changed I know old proverbs made new. I mean, the poet and the writer want to speak that old proverbs made new. It means there I got a nice clue of investigation about how to arrest those criminals. Actually, those who are having false or false background, 
दे शूड गो ऑन अट्रैक्टिंग अदर पीपल क्रिटिसाइजिंग अदर्स थ्रोइंग स्टोन ऑफ क्रिटिसिजम एक्चुअली इट इज द न्यू इट इज दिनो इनो इनो फ्रेशली यू लैव टू थिंक दिस वे एक्चुअली दोज वर लिविंग दोज वर हैविंग फॉल्स बैकग्राउंड दे शूड गो ऑन attacking they should go on throwing stone of criticism to others so that they can feel nervous to attack back to them they can say really so maybe they are you know solid background they have they have their their background is very solid so you should not go this way very tactfully they can ensure their security of falsity this way very tactfully they can ensure their security of falsity this is the full skill this is the application of full skill of cleverness always can be seen applied by those false organizations they are always going to criticize gorya mart gorya mission these that they are all wrong 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 they are themselves wrong they are speaking ignorance is the main source of fighting i think also you have ignorance others why you are going to criticize also you have ignorance you are speaking rightly ignorance is the basic thing ignorance is the root cause of all fighting but i think you are you have also you know ignorance otherwise why you are going to violate your gurudev why you are going to criticize other spiritual organization if we have some right conception right mood not ambiguous mood if you have right you know very nice humble mood then why not do come and try to rectify the situation in goriam or gori mission so by your acharan you are going to open a new thing new rules and regulation it is not approved by shastra this is the new technique this is the new technique spoken by me i mean spoken by the writer to cheat others so a genuine sadhu or his organization or mission never like to criticize others on the other hand they are you know extending their helpful hand they are going to they are they are going to extend their helpful hand to others so that they can also come up criticism is not solution if you want to find some solution out of criticism it is not possible if at all some leader or organization are always going to criticize any other mission or other members of that mission in that case we should clearly understand the weakness lying we should clearly understand the weakness lying with them they have some weakness that is why they are they are, they are, they are actually speaking that way so they have some weakness so this is one kind of dirty strategy this is one kind of dirty strategy of preaching this is one kind of dirty strategy of preaching usually followed it by those cheaters i would like to give one example more from the leela and the teachings of sila prabhupada bhakti siddhanta saraswati goswami thakur those you know sahajiyas are always against sila prabhupada especially you can find those who are sahajiyas they are always against gauri mission and gaur and prabhupada those sahajiyas they are always against sila prabhupad and and his mission always it is their you know regular duty regular responsibility to do something against gauriya mart and gauri mission otherwise they are not going to digest their rice they are going to take they cannot digest their rice they cannot digest the you know lunch they have taken without a criticism they always speaking all rabis against sila prabhupad and his mission 
they always criticize the following they always always like to criticize in the following way how goriamat can approve red cloth where from goriamat arrange sanyas where from goriamat getting sanyas where as all all you know saraga swami they are all with you know white base paramansa rakta vasto vishnaver paritana jo hai those idiot people speaking this way long ago when i was giving answer to the those questions maybe one year ago i was giving this answer that how you know i can stop their face i can make them set up because all approved in shastra red cross sanyas all approved in bhagavatam all the um, you know uh, you know all guru varga like prabodan saraswati adi all they are madhavendra puri pad sir puri pad am chandra guru they all actually sanyas so they are criticizing this way where from gorima are getting red cloth where from gorima are getting sanyas uh they are not doing bhajan they are always running here and there they think running for harikatha they are think they are idiot people they think wasted of time so they are not gorima people they are not doing bhajan so we are doing bhajan yes you are doing bhajan you know spoiling your life that was yeah, that is why you are doing your bhajan how goriamat can keep scarred thread to everybody to make them brahman how is possible for goriamat to keep scarred thread to everybody to make them brahman foolish people <laughs> why goriamat never approve manjari baba to anybody ha eh? they like to apply their thermometer they like to apply apply their thermometer to understand the temperature of goriamat ha eh? fully serious number one <laughs> they, all police people how they can understand the heart of popat and goriam mission all shadago swami they never took sanyas everything they are all white based they criticize in this way they never went for preaching etc they are doing so nice bhajan so let them so let them speak that way let them bark like a street dog let them bark like a street dog while goriamashan moving forward like lion goriamat moving forward like lion you can find the picture of lion in the gate of goriamishan goriamat always but does it mean the birja the power you know ha huh. so we can go ahead another point i like to discuss in a, in this in a context actually those street dogs those street dogs they are shouting in front of those you know people those who are criticizing unnecessarily in front of them i like to speak this nice story very nice what is that i heard it from siddhanti maharaj always i like to identify i always i like to glorify maybe 20 years 25 years back i heard but still i remember i pay bhanavat to them because today my situation very small situation i am getting and you know, because of their kripa so siddhanti mara speaking all street dogs they are they are you know speaking in front of these human beings all those street dogs they are they are you know shouting and speaking ho oh, man you are human being we are we are dog you are human being but what kind of speciality is there with you except only politics and fighting we are fighting from one piece of bread we are only fighting with each other we street dogs we are fighting with each other only for a piece of bread but you are fighting on every each and every ground all the time without police nothing is there in your life you want to prove the uh, big acharya big sanyas yeah but only and only politics is there inside your life 
So the, those street dogs are speaking, oh man, eh? you are human being, but we are dog, street dogs, but we are fighting for a piece of, you know, bread, whereas you are fighting all day and night, eh? without any reason, you are barking. So, let them bark like street dog. While Gorya mission, Gorya mission, Gorya mission, Gorya mission can go forward like a lion. Like a lion. Gorya Mar eternally present. Gorya Mar eternally present in Vaikuntha Dham, Golok Dham. Gorya Mar was invited by Bhaktivinoda Thakur and Prabhupada. Not that Gorya Mar was established by somebody. Gorya Mar eternally present. Eternally present. Be careful before criticizing. You should think over and again. All the members of Gauri Mission, like Sila, Bhakti Pragan Kesav Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Rakakshidur Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Saranga Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Pradip Titta Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Hidaya Ganodip Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Daito Madhav Goswami Maharaj, Sila Bhakti Pramod Puri Goswami Maharaj, Sila Bhakti Bela Bhakti Mayuk Bhagavad Goswami Maharaj, Sila Bhakti Gaura Baikhanas Goswami Maharaj, all, 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 etc., all, including Sila Prabhupada, Sila Bhakti Mayuk Thakur, Sachyana Bhakti Mayuk Thakur, they, they all are lion. They are lion like, they are acharyas, they are each and everybody, they are big, big acharyas like a lion. So they are lion-like big, big acharyas. In front of them, nobody can stand. Nobody can stand. They cannot stand with Siddhanta. They cannot stand with Seva. So they can play politics. This much they can do. They can criticize like a fox. They can criticize like a fox and fly away. They cannot stand. What it concerns to us, let them criticize In the meantime, we are interested to discuss all about the Prabhupada and his unique Acharya Siv. Let them fight with each other. This is the time where the whole world is with, you know, fighting with Corona problem. So we are also fighting with another type of Corona who is going to eat up the vitals of people. So we want to give medicine so that they can get relief. So let them criticize. We are going to discuss all about the Prabhupada and the unique and his unique Acharya Siv. You know, red cloth, I mean saffron cloth or sannyas, brata already approved in all authentic scriptures. Who is going to criticize? He is already approved by, you know, in all Sastras, including Srimad Bhagavatam, Padma Purana, everywhere. Not only that, but also Siman Mahaprabhu was with sannyas based red cloth and most of his associates like, uh, you know, Madhavendra Puripad, Ishwar Puripad, Ishwar Puripad, Prabhadana Prabhadan Saraswati Pad, you know, Damada Pandit, all they are actually all sannyas. They were all sannyasis. Though they are all Paramhansa, still for preaching purpose, this base is important. Prabhupada Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Bhakti Goswami Prabhupada, Kesu Goswami Parambi, Kesu Goswami Siddhanta, they are all actually Paramhansa. But the, out of their humble attitude, they want to prove that we are under, you know, Barna Dharma, we are actually fallen souls, we are, you know, this way, with, out of their humble attitude, they are maintaining their sannyas brother. But actually inside their heart, all Paramahansa, they are all Paramahansa. So, it's one kind of preaching purpose to maintain sannyas, you know, based externally. So, also, as per Pancharatrik procedure, After Vaishnava Diksha, they can accept Paramatik Brahmanatta. Also, as per Pancharatik Vidhan, 
as per the instruction of pancharatrik you know procedure after vaishnavi diksha after actual vaishnavi diksha after actual vaishnavi diksha from actual gurudev sadguru then those devotees they can accept paramarthik paramarthik brahmanatva paramarthik brahmanatva to prove to prove gradually to 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 prove gradually they can they to to try gradually to try gradually to attain the minimum qualification qualification of brahmanism to worship brahmana dev hari why this paramarthik brahmanatva brahmanism scarce at all given are uh, usually given in goriamat by sila popa but the present procedure is not at all perfect popa never wanted to give that way quality and quality and quantity can never be compromised quality and quantity both at a time cannot persist if quality if can if you can compromise with quality then you can get quantity if you can't compromise with quantity then you can get quality ha ah, this way actually qualification of brahmanism they can attend gradually they can try at least through guru vaishnav and bhagwan seva salgram seva they can try but in also in shastra it is written that if some fallen soul shudra if some fallen soul i mean shudra maybe externally he has given take he has taken diksha from one guru but still he is sad shudra in that case if he is going to touch salagram then salagram speaking it seems that he is going to attack me with one trident trident you know i cannot bear his touching so if you are going to maintain your shudraism you have taken diksha na you have taken diksha that i know but still today if you are going to maintain your shudraism in that case you have no right to touch salagram ha eh, dikha matreno after diksha you can get brahmanism it is an ideal speech if you cannot attend if you are going to take false dikha or maybe your gurudev is false or maybe shishya is false in that case you know standard you know siddhanta you cannot get so to attain at least brahman quality popad used to give them be careful you will have to chant brahma gayatri everything try to maintain purity external and internal purity and you day and night right from 3 o'clock in the morning you will have to try over and again to maintain all your brahmin etiquette at least and in near future and in near future only and in near future under the guidance of guru vishnu automatically you can get vaishnavism automatically vaishnavism is a great quality topmost quality vaishnavism so in course of Uh, so also in course of actual hari bhajan automatically devotees can step into raganuga bhajan it's not a matter of joke automatically they can get the scope ha eh? also so many things uh, i was bound to discuss uh, you know and ultimately they can get the clue of manjari bhajan gradually so also in course of actual hari bhajan shun by sila paupad automatically devotees can step into raganuga bhajan and ultimately they can get the clue of manjari bhajan you can remember how exclusive way sila banod singh maharaj was asking some special you know secret points to paupad about raganuga bhajan popat advised him to go through some books special books and popat wanted to help him not only that you know you know soniyam das dadasakam etc etc 
different kind of books you know was prescribed by by professor popat you know uh, some books written by ragunath das goswami prayant at the very secret so all press all you know different kind of health was you know so this way actually uh, silapopat uh we are bound to give instruction to banogoshi maharaj to arrange uh, you know one exhibition in which popal wanted to see different kunja of sakhi manjaris banogoshi maharaj was giving responsibility for this you know exhibition very nice to show that what manjari in which place lalita manjari this lalita bisaka chandralekha you know all you know they are all different and manjari is there different you know kunjas you know it was responsibility was given to banogosi mara to identify babat was very happy with his seva so we must remember some books written by viswana chakoti pat rupagoshi pat you know all we should remember raghunath das goswami you know krishna bhavana mrtu adi etc not that we have no right for you know no right not that only the thing only the thing we will have to attain quality like sahajiya we cannot jump into fire only the advice of gauri amar is to follow usual procedure usual procedure usual procedure to ultimately to get that level to attain that level hmm vidhi margo rato jane sadinata ratno dane rag marge koray pravesh bhakti mr tagor already written this vidhi margo rato jane sadinata ratno dane rag marge koray pravesh so sahajias they are going to you know pass different kind of criticism let them do it those sahajias they forcefully want to commit mistake on this issue like gopi gopi bhav manjari bhav they are all idiot foolish they want to start manjari bhajan before the attainment of that kind of quality maturity that is the mistake they are doing and they are doing they are going to hell forever once sila bhava started speaking harikatha at kunja bihari gauriamat at the bank of sri radha kund radha kund but most of the people they wanted to go uh, go to attend rasa katha rasa katha from sahajias sahajia baba ji they wanted to go to attend rasa katha from sahajia baba ji then sila bhavad was bound to shout don't go there don't go there to get lost for ever from the gauriya bhajan field don't go there to get lost for ever got get lost for ever from the gauriya bhajan field don't go there they are all sahiyas be careful they are all sahajiyas then suddenly those sahajiyas they become very angry they started shouting you all are sahajiyas why you are speaking we are sahajiyas you are sahajiyas you all your groups are they are sahajiyas you all are sahajiyas go away mat we are not sahajiyas sela popat replied in a very you know very smartly right you are right you are really so we are sahajyas but we are aprakita sahajyas we are aprakita sahajyas where whereas you are all prakita sahajyas <laughs> you are all prakita sahajyas we are aprakita sahajyas aprakita sahajya mean what is quite natural quite quite natural in aprakita dham that kind of sahajya you know usual procedure we are following so we are aprakita sahajyas and you all are prakita sahajyas sometime 
Sometimes those sahajiyas they used to insult Sila Pahupat with some unusual questions. Sometimes those sahajiyas they 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 used they used to insult Sila Pahupat with some unusual question like what is the qualification of your guru there? Who is your guru there? What is the qualification of your guru there? What is the qualification of your guru there? What is the qualification of your guru there? Where he is staying? Where he is staying? Any mat address of your guru there, etc. They say all the time they always wanted to insult Prabhupada. Sila Prabhupada used to answer very smartly in front of them. My Gurudev, Guru Pat Padma, Paramahansa Sreshta Jagat Guru, Sila Gaur Kishadas Babaji Maharaj. Externally you cannot externally you cannot find externally you cannot find any educational qualification with him. But be sure. But be sure all the gist of all sastras. All the gist of all sastra authentic scriptures, sastras, could be found in applied form in him, in his life. Be careful that externally you cannot find any educational qualification with my Guru Path Padma, Paramahansa Sastra Gorkisar Bhaji Maharaj, but be sure all the gist, all the gist of all sastras could be found in applied form in the in the life of my Guru Padma. He is a living idealism in my life. He is a living idealism in my life. All the total Vairagya Vidva was found in applied form in the life of Gaur Kisar Babaji Maharaj. Just like just like Sila Raghunathas Goswami Path. All the total Vairagya Vidya was a found in applied form in his life. He is a living idealism for me. His permanent address is the lotus feet of Srimati Radharani at the bank of Radha Kundo. Of course, at present, he is manifesting Bhauma Lila at Rani Chara, Kulia, Navati. Those who are eternally Parshat, those who are eternal Parshat of Gaur Hari or Simati Radharani, for them, their, their external sannyas base, external any base, any attitude is a symbol of extreme humbleness. Those who are eternal persons of Sila Prabhupada, those who are eternal persons of Sila Gaur Hari and Simati Radharani, for them, their external sannyas base is a symbol of ex extreme humbleness. Humble, extreme humbleness of being, of being, the, be, of being in the category of Varnasam Dharma. Is one kind of extreme humbleness of extreme humbleness of being in the category of Varnasam Dharma. But truly speaking, they are all topmost Paramahansa. Actually, eight different kinds of Vigraha, eight different kinds of Vigraha available. You know, all eight, or oh, I can discuss tomorrow on this point. The Sahajiyas, they are fighting with Prabhupada. Where from you are getting sannyas? Eh? They want to criticize. I can discuss this point clearly tomorrow. Eight all different kinds of Bigraha prescribed in Bhagavatam in all Sastra, proved in Bhagavatam. So out of those eight different kinds of Bigrahas are approved, Aleksha, I mean photo is also approved. So Sila Ramanuja Charya took sannyas from the photo of Sila Jamuna Charya at the bank of Ananta Sarovar. At the bank of Ananta Sarovar. Similarly, 
Sila Prabhupada also took sannyas under the guidance of Sila Ramanuja Charya. He also took sannyas from the photo of Paramahansa Jagat Guru Sila Gorgi Sadat Babaji Maharaj at the bank of Sri Radha Kundo, at the bank of Sri Radha Kundo at Brajopatthan. At Brajopatthan. So you should remember what is the excellence, you see. This way, all the time, all the Sahajas, they are always try to criticize. So we are also ready to give fitting answer to them. Let them criticize. Let them criticize, then we can get the scope to clarify this point. They are ignorant. So we can get the scope to answer to their question. We can make them set up. So, yesterday I was discussing about how exclusive way Guru Vaishnav can show their attitude of, you know, love and affection for each and everybody. They are not going to criticize. So, Guru Vaishnav, you know, they are going to see the whole world in relation to Supreme Lord. So, how they can criticize? So, also Srila Prabhupada was too big. Uh, yesterday I already discussed this point. To become very agitated in the humiliation of Guru Vaishnava. This is called actual Vaishnavism. If at all I have any relationship, actual relationship with Guru Vaishnava, then it is not possible for me to, to, to criticize them. If I have actual relationship with Guru Vaishnava, then if somebody is going to criticize, it is my duty to give fitting answer to them. I was discussing this point under the guidance of Shati Devi, you can remember. And Bhakti Vinod Thakur. Another the guide is not Bhakti. Bhakti Vinod Thakur used to say, Tumi to Thakur, Tomar Kukur, Boliya Jano Ho More. Know me, know it for sure that I am your dog and you are my master. So, a dog can prove the topmost sincerity and faith, faithfulness in front of master. So, I am the dog of my Guru Varga, so I will have to answer that way. So now if we can feel this point, then automatically we can get some response inside our heart to take strong action against those criminals, those who are going to criticize Srila Prabhupada and Gaudiya Mission or Guru Varga. We have our duty. <coughs> And many times you remember I was bound to discuss the only duty of an Acharya, the, I can discuss tomorrow again, the only duty of an Acharya is to protect Sampradayak Bhavibhav. The only duty of an Acharya is to protect Siddhantabhani. We cannot allow any people to criticize to write something against Gauriya Mission, Gauriya Mat. We cannot allow. So to protect Siddhanta Bani is the only duty of Anacharya. But at present, they are going to discover so many duties. But Prabhupada was speaking, no! The only duty of Anacharya is to give full protection to Siddhanta Bani. If Siddhanta Bani is protected, then we can go very smoothly with the principle of Prabhupada. I mean, this is the Siddhanta Prabhupada. Also, I heard it from Kesavgu Maharaj. Yes, it is the exact Siddhanta. So, the only duty of an Acharya is to give full protection to Siddhanta Bani. Because if Siddhanta Bani, Vaibhav, is protected, then all other things, you know, we can do very easily. We can run Gauri Mission, Gauri Mot very smoothly. By the instruction of Srila Prabhupada, by the Siddhanta Prabhupada and Bhakti Vinod Chakur, Srila Prabhupada used to say that in the name of Hari Bhajan, we should not do business. 
So he used to say also, Sila Pobad used to say, Sila Pobad Bhakti Shidan to Saraswati Goswami Dhakur used to say very often that to collect huge amount of money or Sila Pobad used to say that to collect huge amount of money, I mean opulence, is not our goal. Because then we can lose our position, we can feel proud, we can become puffed up to ignore, insult Guru Vaishnav. Tahale Prabhupada speaking. Prabhupada speaking. To collect prochur parimane ortho sangraha, prochur parimane ortho vitto sangraha, Amade Jivane Ruddesha Noy, Amra Gauriya Mishan Thake Bolchi. It is not our plan to collect huge amount of money, appliances. This is not our goal. Because if we are going to collect huge amount of money, then we can ignore all Guru Vaishya in Saal. We can feel inspiration to insult Guru Vaishnava. He is, don't go there. They are not Vaishnava. Only I am Vaishnava. Don't go, Goryaman. Don't pay Dandavat to you know, their deities. Don't take Prasadam. Don't attend Harikatha. What is? This is one kind of exhibition of you know, false ego. So, because in that case, you can feel popped up. You can express false ego. And you have the privilege to ignore and insult Guru Vaishnava, to go to hell very easily. So, Srila Prabhupada used to say, to collect huge amount of money or appliances is not our goal, because then we can, we can feel inspiration to insult Guru Vaishnava, ignore and insult Guru Vaishnava. Srila Prabhupada used to say, that I am not going to deposit huge amount of money for you all. Be sure, at present people, present Acharya, they are actually uh, giving service to those disciples. They are going to huge, huge amount of coll collect huge amount of money to preserve for their disciples, so that they can sit doing next to nothing and eat prasadam and, and uh, play politics. They can exercise politics. So, Srila Prabhupada used to say that I am not going to deposit huge amount of money for you all to run the mission smoothly. Be careful about it. Rather, I would like to take huge amount of loan, donation to serve Guru Gauranga Gandharvika. To serve Guru Gauranga Gandharvika, I can take loan, donation. To serve Guru Gauranga Gandharvika the best possible way. So, so, so that you can have your responsibility to pay back the loan and you cannot take rest. I cannot allow you to take rest. You have to do bhajan continuously, non-stop bhajan. So I am be sure that I am not going to you know, deposit money. I am not going to deposit huge amount of I am not going to deposit huge amount of money for you all for you all to run Gauri mission to run the mission smoothly. Rather, I would like to take huge amount of loan from outside to serve Guru Gauranga Gandharvika the best possible way. So that you can have your responsibility to pay back the loan. And at the same time, you cannot take rest. All the time, you will have to do seva, 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 seva. You will have to put huge energy for seva. To find some security of life, to find, to, to find some security of life, to ensure, to find some security of life, to ensure some security of life is not the duty of any sannyas. A sannyasi is not the duty of any acharya, it's not the duty of any sannyasi, it's not the duty of any vamachari. Because in that case, 
दे कैन नेवर डेवलप परफेक्ट शरणागति नाउ वी आर इन ग्रेट यू नो प्रॉब्लम ड्यू टू कोरोना एंड दिस यू नो ड्यू टू दिस सिचुएशन हाउ मच शरणागति वी हैव वी विल हैव टू प्रूव दैट हाउ मच शरणागति वी हैव है नो सो सो so to find some so to find some security to ensure some security of life is not the duty of any sanyasi or brahmachari or any acharya because then in that case they can never develop perfect saranagati that was the perfect siddhant of sila pavapat i like to lead my life very peacefully i like to lead my life very peacefully no disturbance should be there with my in my life this is one kind of passive karma this is one kind of passive karma be careful don't make any mistake this is this mood is one kind of passive karma which is strictly prohibited in gauriya mission gauriya math gauriya sarsak gauriya society this is the exclusive vichar siddhanta vichar of sila pavapa nobody can speak that way nobody can speak that way bhakti mun tag writing you know tomar sevai dukho hai yato seho ta param sukh in your service hey prabhu in your service any amount of problem i am going to face still it is very good i am going to accept gladly i want to put myself in trouble for your seva tomar sevai dukho hai yato seho to param sukh any amount of trouble or suffering or tough sufferings always i like to pay all welcome non stop seva i like to do of guru goranga this is the exact conception and siddhant of genuine gauriya bhakta so for genuine gauriya bhakta there is so many message and instructions of sri pavapad day by day we will have to hear it day by day you will have to we will have to hear it and not only that but also we will have to digest it to understand who is going to cheat me who is going to cheat me how to avoid them is a very very scientific discussion i'm going to do maybe for the coming 6 months i can go on discussing daily if i'm going to discuss daily still i cannot find any end it is endless ocean the pavapad and the and his and and his you know exclusive acharya sir or unique acharya sir i please bless me so that i can go on discussing on this point vancha kalpata rushi ke paas in the bhajpati dan pavan bhavishna bhyona kripaya hori khetan murti dharam dharani varahar ko gaur janam janakadik vasala snigda padam panomami sada prabhu pad padam panomami sada prabhu pad padam panomami sada prabhu pad padam gauranggaik gatir bajasya tamati si gauradham sthiti sa sa saiga vidir gusang virati dusto vetha niskriti si rupai karati sanatananati si jivate jostuti shi shi dant sarasati vijayate gauriya goshti pati shi shi dant sarasati vijayate gauriya goshti pati vancha kalpatarushi ke pasind bhavisha patitanang pavane bho vishnu bhyo namo namah